Hello, you welcome to this tutorial video on how to manage assignments as a teacher and also how to mark assignments as a teacher. Ensure you subscribe to this YouTube channel and also drop a like for this video. How exactly can you be able to send assignments and also mark assignments? It's direct and effortless on the school drive portal. The first thing you need to do is to simply navigate to your teacher's dashboard. You need to just simply go to the top left corner here and click on manage assignments. When you click on manage assignments, you're going to be met with a screen that looks very, very similar to this one. And you can see that this is a list of the previously added assignments. And we are going to be adding one more assignment to a class. And then we are going to be marking the assignment as well in this exact video. So this is the form that is going to direct the assignments to which students are at which time for which purpose so you can just simply click on assignment dates and say on the 28th that is in the next two days and then you say what time 9 let's say 12 and then the time to submit this assignment is 12 o'clock and then by default you can simply go for the class group which is main class group and once you select the main class group the title of the assignment let's assume that the title of the assignment is homework and then once you fill this up as well you're going to select the class you say primary two and you select the subject let's say english language and then you can select the session simply use the current session then you select the term which is also the current stem so by default you select the grading type if this assignment is going to be graded as a ca you simply use and select ca if you don't know how to set up the grading system for your school click on the link above to check it out so let's assume that we're going to be selecting the ca grading system or we can simply just manually add a grade type here so by default let's assume we're using the ce here and then the overall score is 50 so what is the question we can simply say that what is a verb so now that we have the question you can effortlessly also drop a file here in case you want to give them instructional materials to guide them for the assignment itself so since in this tutorial there is none that we want to add to it you simply click on save and when you click on save it's going to notify you with information that looks like this one it simply says assignment added successfully so we're going to be marking the assignment in the next frame that you're gonna see right now so the student is going to attempt the assignment let us assume the student has done the assignment so we're going to be marking the assignment in the next frame we're going to see here we go all right we're going to be checking out how this assignment came in and also how the student has performed and also we're going to be marking this assignment so there are various ways you can actually get to the assignments that the student has already attempted you can make use of the assignment calendar here and since the days you selected for this assignment to be due is on the 28th you can then from there you can see that this assignment is here you can see this right now so you click on mark when you click on mark you're gonna be met with a screen that looks similar to this one now you see here the student is saying that Janet Ade assignment status submitted you check view so when you click on view this is where you're going to get the student's response it says answer is here a verb is an action word so you want to mark it you can give a comment here and say correct and then for the grade you can see the student scored you can drop a grade here by selecting the available grades for five so by default you've marked this assignment then you click on save once you click on save it says that assignment has been graded answer and then here we go it says the grade is 45 so we're sure you've learned something today and in the next tutorial video we're going to be showing you how to set up a virtual classroom on the school try portal that is the most exciting part of school tries features setting up a virtual classroom click on the subscribe button like this video and also you can drop a comment if you have any further questions thank you very much for your time do have a wonderful day